I may have misjudged how insane Kirisugu really is. Because he evacuated the building and then blew it up. I would have liked it if he just blew it up so that no children are crying. Remember about his dreams and ideals to make sure no one will ever cry like that. Kiritsuko let it happen because the kid evacuated. But if the kid was caught up, blown up, his dreams and ideals would have come true. Now, speaking of dreams and ideals, what does Kirei want? The conversation with Gilgamesh was very interesting. Slowly but surely, Kirei is starting to realize that, hmm, maybe there's more to life than just being a homeschooled good little church boy and just listening to what Papi says. Maybe Kirei will figure out once he goes on a date with Kiritsuko now. There's a bunch of other shit happening right now. Caster is preparing his simp mission for Jean who is Saber. Kaneth is still in the building that got blown up, so we should be following up, up after that. And that's pretty much it, I think. Let's bring on today's reaction. Big black ball. Ball of murder. Get away from it, guys. Don't touch. Are you stupid? Thank you so much, Mr. Cram Z returns for the guy five gifted, man. That's very generous of you, but is this guy dumb? He just said it looks like a ball of mercury. It looks like it's alive. Do you want to touch, touch mercury? Like you should be running away from this shit. <laughs> have to move this out of here. I'm gonna assume that this is somehow related to Kaneth and maybe all the other magic shit he was talking about in the building. It's convinced this NPC guy to move it though. It's almost like it's like received like a mission to do it. The red blood cell imagery, did the magic somehow possess him? I, I, I don't know, man. No, I don't think he cares. I think that this is a convenient excuse to use his powers to just gang up on Caster and get rid of competition is what I think is going on. Maybe he cares a bit, but I doubt it. You can literally give additional commands. How does that work? But... So, could he not just give his son multiple command spells? Like, I thought this is something that's just the grail gives you and it, it's over. But he can literally give you more? Yeah, he's fucking using the Saint Quartz right now. He's literally refreshing command spells with Saint Quartz. What's that dude from Naruto? The one that's fucking going around collecting the Sharingans all over his eyes? Danzai or some shit? I forget, but this is reminding me of that. Danzo, yeah, this dude has been going around collecting all unused command spells. He's just stockpiled them all. How many do you have? It's a good incentive for sure. Do you think he's in stockpiling all these fucking command seals just for this war where Kirei has come of age and is now able to participate? And now he's gonna like give them all to Kirei or some shit at the end or some shit. Like, like there's no way this dude doesn't use all these command spells now. There's, there's no fucking way he's just gonna let this war end without using all of this shit. Let's be very mindful of the command spells that he has on his arms. What the fuck, bro? Who's even listening? Hassan's in here, probably. Is Tokyo me ever going to move? Oh, the family foot in there? Okay. But, dude, Tokyo me just camps here. He does not move. He's just in front of this fucking phone thing, and he will not move. He's just sitting here. A five familiars. Kenneth. 
そしてレイジという報酬であればすでに一角を承知動かざるを得ないでしょう他者が追加レイジを手に入れないようそし,てしかしそれだけにレイジを手に入れたマスターには大きなアドバンテージがございます他の猟犬たちに追い詰められ衰弱しきったキャスターにとどめを刺すのはなければなりますまい That's the script When everyone has gained up Gilgamesh will show up and finish it is what you think will happen but will it really see about that Archer でなければなりますまいあのいいでしょうか Is this Waver's place? それはここの家主のせいでしょういないスカンダル様っていらっしゃいますか That's me よのことだな I see のサインをお願いしますいや、署名かよろしい。You wanna know? You wanna... Are you a fan? ありがとうございました。He bought a new shirt. It feels good to have the entire world mapped across my chest. Riders, admirable shirt, war tactics. What the fuck is he doing, bro? He's discovered the King of Conquerors has discovered what Amazon is. <laughs> is the King of Conquerors, Mr. Iskandar, here? He should go to Starbucks and also say, Yes, I am that King of Conquerors. Casual clothing. Dude, I love how he's just like adapting to like the modern ages the best right now. From the beginning, like Ryder has been fucking down, bro. This is hilarious. <laughs> That is true. Right, Saber has the black suit thing. He's gonna think he's a bodybuilder, bro. Go on without it if you want. He just looks like a bodybuilder in public. Come on, let him go. <laughs> He's actually gonna go kill a servant and then come back. Alright, pants, please. Alright. Pants. Yeah. And wait till he realizes that Gilgamesh has casual wear too and can just walk around. The rider would get so upset. キャスターの居所を突き止めなきゃいけないってのに。エンゾーさんには流動寺を起点として協力な結界が生まれている。綺麗、オールドターゲットさんの言う的ない。セイバーを使う上では留意しておいてくれ。おしっ、マヤ。
using Saber as bait and taking out other targets I think is a smarter idea. Exactly. Because I'm also a rotten piece of shit. I don't think about honor. I don't care about the sanctity of a duel. I'm here to fucking win, bro. No matter what it takes. If it means blowing up a building with kids inside, I'll fucking do it. If it means using Saber as bait and then taking out other targets that's focused on caster, absolutely I'll do it. Saber hates this, huh? Yeah. This is like the exact opposite of the chivalry of a knight. Saber probably thinks that this is so underhanded, but it's like, what are you gonna do? This is your master. You know, Kaneth and Lancer, as well as Saber and Kiritsugu, it's kind of similar, huh? About how both knights want like, the sanctity of a duel, but both masters are just doing underhanded shit just to win. Because my strategy is higher rate of success than yours. Pretty much. Ignore it again. Yes, Risei, bro. That Kotomine Risei guy, that dude's super omega sus, bro. Yep, he knows. Yep, okay, he's so good. Holy shit, Kirisugu is so good. He, he understands the entire fucking plot. Saber ignored twice, bro. Hmm? We have in a fucking episode 18 moment right now? A re zero? Hold it. You want to run away? Everything just. This is the most emotional I've ever seen Kiritsugu. I've never seen him actually talk like this before. Like, he. This is really like digging into him, huh? Okay. I thought that he would say fuck the daughter and then I would be tripling down and oh my god he's the worst father ever. Hmm. It's like the it's like two there's like two wolves in Kiritsugu. <laughs> Let me cook. The first one is the Kiritsugu that we've seen, the one that is so ruthless and cold and has been an assassin, a terrorist, and is willing to do anything it takes to like achieve his dreams and ideals. But the second is, he just wants to retire and just live in peace and just go away and enjoy some, some normalcy, right? To have a family and settle down. Yes. This is the most emotion I've ever seen from Kirisugu. <laughs> きっとあなた自身が最初で最後の断罪者として怖いんだ。やつが前に聞いた。いや、ディスカメント。僕を連れ去ってきて。で、ウォーヴァリーンズ、ブロ。して戦うのに。イリアを残したままなのに。舐め
敵は誘いをかけていた。Shit. Is it Caster? Caster's literally coming in with an army of children, bro. Hello. He knows. He knows. He's smiling. He's、so、a prepared. Game attack. <laughs> Caster's grip strength was fucking crazy. I mean, we've seen him just bash a kid's face in before, but like, okay. But knowing him, well, I don't know if Caster. Yeah, I bet he could. Like, If they had explosives, like if I were a caster to use the kids as hostages, maybe, but also I would have probably like implanted some sort of bombs on each kid. t h e r e every one of them is like a suicide bomber right now running around. That would be like the smartest thing to do. k i r i t s u g u would probably just kill the kids though. I don't think he cares, right? So, you're not saying that you're going to be a good one. No, John, what does he go to say? Okay. But she's nerfed, man. This is a bait. Bullets? Maya? I don't even know you, bro. <laughs> Remember, what, what, is, what is Bluebeard thing, bro? How do you just like savor the terror? You give the kids hope first, and then when they think it's good, you take it away from them. The kids probably spirit suicide bomb. Suicide bomb. <laughs> Yo, these tentacles. Is, 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 is Saber about to get diddled? Oh, oh. Usually, Leafa from SAO will be in these kind of situations, right? But, oh. Oh, mana? I'm just gonna assume that's just pure mana at this play here. Oh, I mean, the kid, they ain't really kids anymore, but it's never ending. I think Caster has more. Sorry, I did you to the Shiroka and Nidic. Saber touched on a domino. Saber got Hanata Basho de Tatakati, Rijo, and Zendunai. Book your Nuski. No, he's not that smart. It's just Caster here, right? Oh, someone else. Oh, shit. We're getting a double team. Who's here now? He seems to have an infinite supply. Prelati Grimoire. So his Grimoire just gives him infinite mana. That's pretty OP. Well, I don't know if it's infinite mana actually. It seems like it's more specific to like demonic legions. And he can just keep summoning demonic legions with this grimoire. Or is it the mana? I don't know. What is like a prelati? Hold up. I want to Google this shit. Prelati. 
Francois Prelati was an Italian cleric and an alchemist who took part in the murders committed by Gilles de Rye in the 15th century actual lore. Hmm, okay, okay, that's pretty cool. Save her face, bro. You got the wrong girl! I wasn't even there. He got the exact wrong fucking lore, bro. This is King Artoria, not Jean. But hey, at least we're getting a lot of like history lessons through Jean, right? Soundtrack went crazy. <laughs> Lancer! <laughs> I thank you so much for the help, Giga Chad. But bruh, it's thanks to you that I'm nerfed right now. What do you fucking mean? This this is all your fault, bro. What do you mean disappointing? Fucking put the curse off me. Nightshivalry, baby. Oh, you're gonna go bald at this rate. <laughs> Gillis just got cucked. A handsome man, an Ikemen just showed up and just stole Saber from Gillis, bro. It's not fair. It's not fair. The hot guys always get all the bitches, not me. <laughs> That's beyond obsessive. Oh, it's not a love affair, bro. Night nice chivalry, bro. That honor. Okay, so helping us Saber isn't going against us, so it's fine. If I was Kiritsuga right now, do you know what I would do? If I was Kiritsuga right now, do you know what I would do? Activate command spell. Backstab Lancer. And then her arm would also be unsealed. And then she could be Caster and Lancer, right? That would be the objective correct decision. If you want to win this fucking thing, if you're serious about fucking winning this, this is the moment to use a command spell to make Saber kill Lancer, unseal the left arm, and then kill Caster Row. Straight up. That's how I do it. Right. Oh shit! The Mercury- Yo! It's the- It's the Mercury thing that we saw! So this must be how we survive the building explosion, right? They're attacking Kirisugu's manor. Holy shit. Both Caster and Lancer at the same time. Okay, I mean, I do want to see Kirisugu fuck this guy up, so let's go. <laughs> like, it, it's just Mercury Rimuru. It's a Mercury slime that's just like super powerful, right? It seems like it. It's like a fucking blob that just is OP, right? Honor? <laughs> he thinks that we're about honor, bro. No, we don't care about honor. We care about winning. Ignored. Where's Kitsugo at? CCTV. Crazy trap. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So basically, auto defense. Kaneth is completely fine because this Mercury Slime will literally protect him from fucking anything. Wow, holy shit. So the wire trap, boom, and then the statues, shotgun pellets, boom, explosions. Crazy shit, but Kaneth, Mercury Slime, man. <laughs> this thing's busted. <laughs> Bro, don't act 
like you're above Kiritsugu. You rely, you rely on this fucking slime. You are getting hard carried by this fucking thing. Come on, man. Well, technically, it's like magic, though, you know? It's like a mage's pride, right? He thinks that they're going against the Einsburns, right? But, like, them resorting to traps like this is not mage's pride. I think that's what it's all about. Okay. Where's Maya at? Hmm. Slime Daru. Oh. Holy shit. Yo, can Kiritsuko fight this guy with just guns still? Like, can it just... Kiritsuko has guns, but this guy has like this insane fucking ability with the slime. Like, what's you gonna do to shoot it? I don't think the bullets are gonna do shit. Nah, man, it's not gonna do anything. What the fuck is time, Axel? Time alter double Axel. Slow motion. Oh my god. Oh my god. He's a superhuman too. Oh, what the fuck is this? He's moving up twice speed right now? What is this shit, bro? This is so hype. A reality marble in your own body to control time and accelerate. Like, I'm reading what you're saying, but I don't really understand. But time alter, huh? He can, like, literally accelerate at the factor of double the speed. Holy shit. Sick. I love that magic. I guess he can't use it much? Oh, that took a lot out of him. Triple? Yeah. How high is this gonna go? How fast can you fucking go? We had double. You go triple immediately, bro? <laughs> oh. It's hard? Third of its original. So he's slowing at that time. So he can fast, slow. By doing this, we avoid the senses. Okay, so this is not like triple XL. No, no, no. This is. What, what did he stagnate, right? Track, I, I was too hyped. I thought that he was going triple XL there for a second. I was like, oh my god. No, no. This is triple stagnate. The exact opposite. His heartbeat is literally slowing down so that this thing cannot sense us right now. The heartbeats, bro. Penis. No, 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 that's that's stupid. I know he's smart. There's no reason to yell Kenneth and shoot like that. There has to be a reason why he said his name there. I refuse. Penis. No. That's intentional. The pistol. The pistol. <laughs> what? What is special about this gun? What is special about this? Because he <laughs> literally compared this thing to his kid. He, he has like a name, Walther? His name is Walther, right? He's like, oh, it's this heavy. And so is my daughter. <laughs> She's already eight years old. <laughs> so, like, this thing is like his baby, bro. And like, what is this gun gonna do? So, he calls his name to shoot at it. Of course that's stupid, but it's intentional. To let us guard down? He switches guns. Pistol comes out. And that smirk tells me that this thing should penetrate. Whatever Mercury Shield this is, that's what I'm just gonna assume, right? <laughs> and that's it, man. Forest of Demons, 130 hours till the end of the Grail War. Oh my god, dude. In terms of like cool powers, time, like, 
Time Alter might be one of the sickest power I've ever seen in Fate right now. I, I know I haven't seen much magic so far. Like, Kanith is like, slime thing is pretty fucking OP. Like, if I had that thing, I'd probably be as cocky as him. But, like, this Time Alter, Double XL, Triple Stagnate, who knows? Can he do Triple XL, Quad XL, Penta XL? Like, dude, it's so fucking sick. Holy shit. Like, I don't know, the, the whole concept of like moving that fast by having like a reality marble in your internal domain. I don't know what the fuck that really means, but it causes a lot of stress within him. But he can also move by that multitude. So it's like a perfect magic for an assassin like him to move around, right? Man, this shit's fucking hype. Uh, what happened today? Some funny stuff with Ryder in the beginning. I think the most important thing is how Risei is abusing his powers to gang up on Caster. I don't think he really cares about the murders. Maybe he does, but it's a convenient excuse to get everyone to take down a comp competition. Risei also has a shitload of command spells that he's been collecting throughout the years, I guess. And I don't trust any of them, bro. I do not trust any of them. Right now, we're getting attacked by Caster and his kids, as well as Kanith and his slime. I think that Saber and Lancers, they're gonna be fine. I have no worries that Saber and Lancers are gonna be fine. I'm more worried about Kiritsugu. Kiritsugu versus Kanith, this is gonna be very interesting, because like, yeah, I know Kitsuku is like strong, but everything has been like assassination attempts through sniping or exploding buildings. This is a direct 1v1 combat now. And I'm like, how is he gonna fight? He's just a regular human, right? Nah, bro. Time alter. Time alter, bro. This is our fucking answer. And we have a special gun here. My guess is that this gun, Walther, can penetrate the slime. That's it for me. If you're still here though, if you enjoyed this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for even more content. And until next time, take care.